Hey guys, what's up? Back with another video. Today we have a brand that I've never reviewed on my channel before and until about eight days ago I had never owned before. It is Leaning Way of Weight specifically. As you can tell by this box right here, or maybe you can't tell if you're not too uh, informed about the Way of Weights because I know a lot of people don't even own any. This is the 2.5 box. This is a special colorway of the 2.5 box. Usually they're just white, black, and red, but this is black and gold. This is the Gold Rush colorway as you can tell by the title obviously but this is an amazing shoe. Uh, I'm going to give you a quick aesthetic review before we get into that. It did come with a couple extras. It came with two stickers right here, two Dwayne Wade stickers as you can see in Dazzle Camo, his face in Dazzle Camo. I'm going to be putting one of these on a side table that I have where I put stickers on and one of these I'll just keep in the box. And also, like all leanings, or Dwayne Wade leanings, it came in this really nice dust bag right here with your gold and black Dazzle Camo right there. So if you guys could hit the like button before I pull out this shoe, that would be greatly appreciated. It does go a long way in helping out my channel, and it means a lot to see that you guys are enjoying these videos. But here we have it, guys. This is the Leaning 2.5 Encore Way of Wade Gold Rush. That's a mouthful. I probably said it in the complete wrong order, but this is a beautiful shoe. As I said, quick aesthetic review. I'm going to tell you some stuff that you need to know about the shoe after that. So let's start with the bottom. As you can see, we have an entirely icy blue bottom. Really, really nice looking bottom. I love the traction pattern on it. You have your black carbon fiber shank plate in this little prism triangle design right here on the midfoot. Your Way of Wade logo right there on the ball of your toe. There's a bit of yellowing on the heel, which I will touch on later. But overall, an amazing looking outsole. Moving on to the midsole, we have a split midsole. We have white on the majority of the forefoot and then it splits to black on the midfoot and the heel. Right here on the midfoot we have our carbon fiber shank plate coming up onto the bottom half of the midsole and black foam on the back half. The entire midsole is covered with a metallic silver paint speckle which is a really nice contrast to this gold upper. This upper is a pretty nice leather if I do say so myself. It is coated in gold paint, not real gold. These things would cost an arm and a leg if it was real gold. This is just gold metallic paint, not real but it's a nice leather, really nice looking paint. As you can see, the toe box features perforations all across. From what I understand, these do not actually really help breathability when playing basketball, but it's a nice aesthetic look in my opinion. On the midfoot right here, we have this leather paneling, which looks really cool. It's been embossed into these triangle and prism designs, 3D embossed leather. It's not plastic under there, it's just been embossed. It looks really cool. Underneath that, you have these black Nubuck triangles, as well as black nubuck running around the ankle collar with your gold leaning logo embossed into it. It's not printed, it's not stitched or anything, this is not going to fall off, it's a nice embossed logo. The tongue is a black breathable mesh, it is pretty thick for padding but you can feel that the air is going to go through it and heat is going to escape from it. And black and gold laces with your little W's for Dwayne Wade obviously. These are not 3M laces, sadly, but they still look very nice and nonetheless. Of course, you got your black eyelets right here, big black plastic eyelets with a big groove there, flex groove. And the tongue, taking a look at this amazing tongue, all gold with your black Way of Wade logo in this black nubuck with a white embossment on it. The heel cup is a gold plastic. This is pretty sturdy pretty sturdy heel cup with a black nubuck panel underneath. Finally taking a look at the sock liner, all black and white dazzle camo. Like look at that, that looks amazing. I'm a huge fan of that dazzle camo. If you're wearing these with joggers or with shorts and you see that dazzle camo poking up, it is a really good look in my opinion. But that wraps up what the shoe looks like, obviously you can see that. But some things I think you should know about this shoe, retail for $225 on shop.wayofway.com if you guys are wondering where to buy these. You can also get them at sunlightstation.com for around $220. I believe they also do come with a pair of Rock'em Apparel socks to match in a gold prism colorway. But these are an amazing shoe. Quality as far as that is concerned I'd say is very good. I know some other YouTubers expressed concerns with that, how it was yellowing on the heel before they even got them. As you can see I have a bit of yellowing right there but it's gonna yellow. Like that's I'm not losing any sleep over that. Also, people were saying that their pairs came pre-creased. Uh, my left shoe did a tiny bit, as you can see right there, but I'm gonna wear them. Like, they're gonna crease 
when I wear them. So if they're a tiny bit pre-creased before I wear them, once again, I'm not losing any sleep over it. The leather quality is pretty good. I'd have to say it's not like people make leaning sound like they're using $800 leathers on their shoes, but it's good leather. It's really good leather. It's not like blow your mind leather, but it's really good leather for the price you're paying. These are still available, as I said, so I definitely recommend getting them. As far as sizing goes, go true to size, or if you need to, go half size down. I would not recommend half size up. Just half size down because the leather can stretch out. That's what I did. I got a size 12. It fits snug, but not too snug. Just the way I like it on a shoe like this, a nice raw material leather shoe, I like to fit a bit more snug. Just like my Jordans, I get a size 12 in Jordans as well. But that's going to pretty much wrap up the review, guys. Let me know what you think of the Leaning Way of Wade 2.5 Encore Gold Rush in the comment section below. Hit that like button if you haven't already. And if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button for new sneaker videos every single day. I'll see you guys tomorrow with my weekly sneaker rotation. So until then, peace.